You already know what time it is. I got to hit it. Uh... All right. you to take all that frustration out on Kofi in your match tonight, but I want you to know this is an open, judgment-free zone for you to speak freely. Can I actually have any questions? It, this, let, let me explain something. I, I'm on your side. I commend you for throwing Jey Uso to the wolves. I would have done the same thing. I repeat, I would have done the same thing. So you want to question, okay, why would bold Scottish warrior lead Jey Uso to be beaten down by the Judgment Day? I want to make one thing really clear. I am absolutely nothing like you, Miz. Ashley, we're a lot alike. In what way? Is a very Miz move. Wow. Also, we both know what it's like to be the backbone of this company, to take it to new heights, to be the hardest worker inside and outside of this ring, and become champion. True. Okay, maybe. Okay. To lose it. You are the unwavering, unbeatable WWE champion, Drew McIntyre. Uh. So you weren't. And then you received an opportunity of a lifetime. An opportunity at Clash at the Castle in your own backyard, in front of your own people. Uh, so I wouldn't bring that up. Again, and what happens? The bloodline happens. And who was front and center to give you beatdown after beatdown after beatdown? The tribal chief's right hand man, Jay Uso. So, I think it's safe to say you don't trust Jey Uso, and rightfully so, because Jey always... Look at Drew's eyes. He looks like he's about to blow a gasket. So judgment Day put the boots to him. Karma's a bitch. Yeah. Exactly. Jey made his bed, and last week he finally had to sleep in it. You know what? You are the Batman of WWE. And I guess that makes the American Nightmare Cody Rhodes Superman. Speaking of which, how did it feel to be upstaged by Cody last week? Ooh. Ah. I wanted to see where that was going to go. Dang it. Big D, Drew McIntyre. Whoa, hey, yo, whoa, hey, pause. Because the Drew McIntyre that we know is not a coward like you showed us last week. Who are you calling a coward? I mean, for real, for the past few years, we've been calling you Big D. Okay, can we stop? But as of last week, it looks like there's been a little bit of shrinkage on your end. Ooh! Drew, no. What's wrong, Drew? What's wrong? You scared? Or were you just worried that that big old sword you got was just a little too limp to get the job done? Bro, if I'm Drew McIntyre, I'd have hopped over that. We're having a conversation on this. Oh, sorry, sir. Sorry. You just expect Drew McIntyre to save the day like always. I know you two were back there. Did you come out and do something? No. Multiple superstars did nothing. The one guy that came out, Cody, he wasn't doing it out of the goodness of his heart. It's his mess, Jay is here, and he's trying to clean it up. And what I seen tonight was the actions of a hypocrite. Actions of a hypocrite. Wow. Drew, you didn't do what you were supposed to do, Drew. You should have helped Jay out. Oh, shame. Shut up, this. <laughs> you remember all those beatings from the Usos, all those opportunities taken away by the bloodline, what Roman did to you, Woods. You just forgive and forget. Doesn't have to earn that trust back now. No, no, we remember it. We remember it as clear as day. If anyone remembers it, yep. we remember it. But that was not the time, Drew. Jay Uso is here, and he's trying to make it right. Oh, make it right. Are you kidding me with that? Shut up, miss. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Like, what the freak?
freak, man. Everything Jay's done to you guys, you haven't stepped to him one time. Because true, true, we are watching you all the time. We watch you from the back. We look up to you, man, because we know as sure as the sun rises in the east. This is racist, yeah. Drew McIntyre is always going to do what is right, and we respect you for it. Do you know what this means? Shut up, Miss. Oh, my God. Miz, their chance, shut up, Miz. Look, Miz, just shut up, bro. Oh, he glass, he had butted him with the glass globe kiss. I think the time for talking is over. Kofi, get in this ring and you'll find out what hard times is all about. Oh. Drew says, shoot me, my fade. <laughs> Drew's still cold, bro. Oh, 